Well, hello and welcome back here to Don't Starve. We are day seven with Willow, and so far we haven't burned the entire uh, world down. So, not doing too bad so far, I would say. Um, let's have a quick look at the map now. My big worry at the moment is the lack of spiders. Uh, spiders are going to provide us with silk, which is going to be very important to us. I'm thinking that this area seems like the uh, the best place to start because it is um, quite near to our base. So just south of us, there's large unexplored areas. So what we're going to do is we're going to take a look down there and see what we can find. Also, the other thing I want to make is the alchemy engine and that will get our science going and also and I'm saying also an awful lot let's get as much of our resources set up as possible let's have a quick look down here okay no bunny visitors during the night that's not surprising um, I have some rot with which I can fertilize things, but I'm not going to do that just yet. The reason for that being I'm not entirely certain I want the plants laid out the way they are, thinking about it, because I'm a little bit worried about uh, our lovely Willow's fire starting abilities, so I get the feeling I might be moving some stuff around, but in the meantime Let's get ourselves a little bit organized, shall we? So just get through that. Uh, to store those graft tusks and the saplings. Uh, we only have three gold. Chester, do you have some gold? You have some gold. Good, Chester. In fact, let's grab some of this stuff out because we don't want to lose it. Um, drop that down there. I'm going to need to find flowers because I'm going to need to make myself another garland but we can do that later on so um, let's store that treasure we don't need that just yet hold on to the gears and hold on to those um, flint sticks yeah let's store these gems there we go okay now can we make Can we make yet a an ice box? An ice box. We require dress stone. Okay, well we can do that quite easily. Uh, boards, cut stone. There we go. Okay, and that should now allow us to make an ice box. We need an alchemy engine for that. Okay, so let's quickly just start looking at what we need for the alchemy engine. Um, Board, stress stone, and electrical doodads. Do, 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 da, da, da. Okay, so we want that. Uh, we're going to want a couple more of those, so we're going to need to go get some stones. Um, we won't bother making the boards just yet for that reason, then. So let's make ourselves another electrical doodad. There we go. That makes things a little bit easier to stack, and we'll stack those away. Where is. Okay. Oh, we got no space anyway, so it looks like we're not doing that. Uh, finally, let's, can we use that pig skin yet? Morning star, hand bat, no, don't want to make a hand bat. Uh, football helmet, that's what I want to make. We need some rope for that, so let's make ourselves some rope quickly. There we go. And marble suit, football helmet, there we go. Need an alchemy engine for it, of course. All right. Okay. So let's let's move on. It looks like getting stone is going to become our priority over finding um, spiders today. But as we know where loads and loads of stone is, that shouldn't be a problem. 
what is the problem is we actually spent most of the day so far doing this. So it is time to well get our get our buttocks in gear, shall we say? Yeah. Oh, I didn't realise just how hungry we were. That's not a good sign. Right, grab that. Run away from that. It's a good thing we've got loads of food on us. Run away some more from that. And try try going in the right direction. That would probably help us, wouldn't it? Uh, do we have a fire on us just in case? There you go, just in case we need it. And I think we probably will at this point. Uh, probably survive through a little bit, then we'll cook up some carrots. Oh, actually, we'll cook up this birch nuts now, so that'll be good. Don't see a pickaxe, so let's take the opportunity to make one of those. We need sticks. There's one. Ooh, bit of food, we won't say no to that. Yeah, it looks like we are staying out here tonight. It's taken a while to get things organised, but not necessarily a bad thing. Okay, we can now make ourselves a pickaxe. Uh, what's that? Oh, it's just a tree, okay. Alright. Grab that. So I'll grab that trap as well, now, to be honest with you. Um, right, okay, let's get ourselves some stone. Right. Chester, come here, dear boy, come here. Let's see if we can balance out our food a little bit. So that, then food, um, stuff. rope on us at the moment, don't need that at the moment. Gosh, I knew what that rumbling sound was, it started to dis disconcert me just a little bit. Right, okay, I think we're going to stop there. It's getting incredibly late, we're about to starve, so let's stop for the night. I'm just going to cook up these birch nuts. And I'll see you all in the morning. Well, good morning everyone. Here we are, back again, day eight. Fairly simple task ahead of us. Let's get a load of stone. And then we can finish off our science engine, and then hopefully we can get on with our planned search for spiders. So there's loads and loads of things we want to build, and to be honest with you, most of the things we want are from the alchemy engine. So this will be good for us. Ooh. Ding dong. Spiders. Okay, that's that sorted out. Okay, let's make... Uh, can we make ourselves? No, we can't, because we're still completely out of twigs. But we've just seen a spider's nest. Let's see if we can find a path around to it, and hopefully we'll find a lot of twigs at the same time. I'm just going to put this, the, uh, the shovel back on the bar. Because... Uh, <clears throat> excuse me, because... I want to pick all this stuff up. Okay, loads of twigs, which is just what we need. Uh, that's going to help us get a bit more organised again. Before I forget, 
Let's make ourselves a fire, just uh, keep it in the background there. Do for logs. We could actually use a tree or two, couldn't we? So let's make let's grab some of that as well. Here's my axe. There it is. So grab a tree. Get our logs back up to about 20. Get stumpy as well. Uh, 19, I think 19 is close enough to be honest with you. Grab these on the way through. Okay, oh, this is a dense forest. This is worth remembering. Plenty of stuff here. There's a spider's nest. Excellent. Let's just make sure that's that's not quite on the map. Let's make sure that gets on the map. There we go. Right, there's one. Let's get the other one as well. There's the other one. Make sure it's on the map. Great. Now, where's that trap I picked up earlier? Can I give it to you, Chester? Yes, I did. Excellent. Right, we'll have that. Which one's going to be easier to to use? I think. Yeah, this one will do nicely. Okay, so we'll pop the trap down here. Hello. Come on. Here we go. All right. Ah, uh, silk. Just what we needed. Okay. Come on. Yeah, you're supposed to get in the trap. There we go. I knew you'd get it eventually. Come on, in you get. Brilliant. Okay. Alright, and... Come here, Chester. There we go. Store that. Brilliant. Um, grab that on the way past. Okay, right. Let's start heading back to base. Right, we have some important things now. Grab this shovel. Let's get some more sticks on the way through. Well, it seems that it's day eight. We've achieved most of our goals. Day nine. Let's do some stuff around base, shall we? Um, we need to start thinking about impending um, visits from the dogs at this point as well, which is one of the reasons why I want to get the alchemy engine done. Uh, Hidden bush, thank you very much. All out of crouching tigers, which personally I'm quite happy with. But stumpy on the way past. Uh, I, the other thing I wanted to do was get a, make a pitchfork and grab some of this stuff to make paths out of. I don't think we're going to be able to do that this time round, but it's going to be high on our list, I think. Okay, so. Have that. Thank you very much. Don't mind if I do. Why do we have two stacks of saplings? Because they only stack to ten. Okay, that's a good reason. I think we're going to make it home. We might actually have to spend another night out. Yeah, well, we're almost there. Uh, let's see, we just rush through. Frog's legs, I think. Well, obviously, we're too loaded down. Never mind. Here we are, back to base. Nearly, nearly dark. Um, we appear to have lost some rot. Okay, that's annoying, but never mind. Right, let's get something in the fire. 
Um, not Chester. Put some wood in instead. Okay, so. We should now be pretty much in a state where we can get a lot of the things we need do, to do done. So let's concentrate on that quickly. Uh, what else do I not want? I don't want that hammer for a bit, so that can go in Chester. There we go. Um, actually, I think I can live without most of this. Alright, okay, let's get some let's get some science done. Now what do we need for the alchemy engine? Uh, what we need is two electrical doodads, two blocks of stone, and four boards. So Chester, do you have me doodads, mate? You have me doodads. Uh, okay, so one, two and two. This is such an expensive recipe. Uh, each one of those boards is four logs. That's pretty much done us up for wood. Uh, yeah, we're down to two, would you believe it? Ah, you get to see me go through an entire night. That's makes a change in this game. So there we go. Alchemy engine. Dire straights hit, they never actually made. Right, Alchemy Engine, brilliant. So, uh, Chester, that's a good chap. Oh, I want that pigskin, I want that rope. Uh, okay. I don't want the map, I don't know why I did that. Uh, now, let's. Football helmet. Why are you not making your football helmet? Because I was a pixel away from the alchemy engine. Fair enough. Okay, right. <clears throat> Excuse me. We'll put that there. And go to food. Ice box. So gears, gold, and stone blocks. We can do that. Right, stone blocks. Do you have my gears, Chester? Yeah, you do. Excellent. Okay, that gives us an ice box, which is marvellous, because that is going to stop all this food we've got from spoiling quite so fast. Let's get that all chucked in. Um, Chester! Yeah, give me that monster meat. Okay, we'll chuck that in there. Alright, so let's go and get some real meat. Actually, let's eat that first. Yum! Excellent. Okay. Okay, I was worried about that. Alright, uh. Uh, fortunately, those rabbits starve to death. Fortunately, though, they leave us the, the meat. And also, um, I'm not sure I'm particularly comfortable with this fact, but let them die this way doesn't mean we're, means we're not naughty, which just doesn't seem right to me somehow. Hello, bunny. And goodbye, bunny. Okay, right, that's... That's food. Now let's get some of this sorted out. Let's get a meal on the go and then let's get some of the bushes and saplings and things like that we picked up down. So open that up, open that up. And we'll have one of these. We'll have our monster meat and let's use up some of these carrots because they're going stale. That'll cook up in a minute. I think I left my heart in San Francisco. No, I think I left some bushes and saplings and grass tubs in here. Oh, that didn't make meatballs. That surprises me, but never mind. I think I can survive. Plant that one. No, I said plant that one, you fool. 
Plant it, I say. Plant it. Can we fit one more in there? We can. Excellent. Okay, and... Let's do it this way, it's easier. I'm oh, just coming, honey, for, for fire. Alright, uh, where's we rot? There's that, okay, rot. And let's get these trees, uh, bushes, all fertilised and wonderful. There, they be growing a treat now. Ah, look, and we're getting some sticks, which we really, really needed recently. Okay, and we might as well fertilize these as well because, as I'm sure you guys remember, during the winter we are really going to start needing this grass. So, let's put it from the top down; it's easier, as, especially when, especially when Chester stands in the way like that. Oh, Chester, out of the way. There we go, and uh, hold on to the rest of that, that's good. Alright, uh, grab these traps, your meat will not hurt. Okay, uh, murderize some bunnies, grass tufts, saplings, where are my grass tufts? I'm sure I found more than that. Rust tufts, there we go, I knew I found more than that. Oh okay, yeah, so let's get these planted out. Chester, out of the way. It's a good lad. There we go. Right, because we are running out of day here. There we go, and... I don't know why I bother trying to make these neat. They look terrible. There we go, so... No, we'll do those in the morning because we are just about out of time. So let's get back to the fire. Stick our last two logs in it. Okay, now there's one more thing I want to make, which is the pitchfork. Okay, and I will use that tomorrow. But tomorrow, spicy chili. Yes, that hit the spot. It burns like fire. Um, yes, uh, that will have to be it for now. I'm afraid. So let's stick in one of those. Get some carrots in there as well. Cook that up, whatever it may be. And actually, we'll start some of this stuff drying as well. Okay, um, that's it. Day nine. Tomorrow will be day 10, and uh, we'll be playing that next episode. And so until then, I've been Simon Parsons. This has been Plants vs. Plants vs. Zombies. Good Lord. This has been Don't Starve. Thank you, and good night.